Force Fiona, which is currently currently pulling north of the island of Hispaniola and eventually leaving the Turks and Caicos region. But Gaston is the next system that gained a name. It's in the open North Atlantic waters. The systems will continue to move on a northerly course, both Fiona and Gaston, so they are not, they are not going to have an impact here in the United States or Florida for that matter, except for maybe some higher swells in those coastal regions. Gaston will stay in the northeastern side of the Atlantic, but our disturbance, just labeled 98L for examination and investigatory purposes, it's being sheared apart somewhat by those faster winds just to that north region, but it's going to start to leave that zone of faster winds and move into a very warm and lighter upper environment across the Caribbean. So that's why over the next three to five days, there's a high probability of it becoming a tropical system. And all we have to go right now are just the basic forecast models. They are imprecise, as you probably know, especially as you go forward in time. But what we do have, amongst other sources of data, is that it's going to track to the west, and then somewhere by the weekend, early next week, it's forecast to make a turn to the north. There's going to be some pattern shifts that we're going to have to monitor very closely, especially what comes closer to us when it comes to cold fronts. That can really determine where eventually it goes. But it's going to be this weekend before we have any kind of real clear insight into what may happen with this system. And we don't even have forecast cones yet. It has to get that potential tropical cyclone or tropical depression phase in order to have the official forecast cone. So time is on our side. We'll continue to monitor things. Don't see a, a one frame model on social media and say that's what's going to happen here. The forecast uh, data goes all across the Gulf. So point being, we're in monitor mode, not panic mode. Uh, just be in the know as far as how things develop over the next five days and beyond. But locally, 